CBS News Bay Area. This is the evening edition. Now at 11, a nail-biting finish in front of a sold-out crowd. How Base FC fared in their home own opener and what it means to fans to have a women's professional team in the Bay Area. I feel like we get overlooked a lot in the Bay Area. It's about time that, that we stand up and show up. And the governor adding more eyes on East Bay roadways with close to 500 cameras. What the community has to say about it. And it's one of the most holy nights in the Christian calendar. How some held vigils tonight leading up to the Easter holiday. Thanks for joining us. I'm Brian Hank. And I'm Andrea Nakano. It was a close one tonight in San Jose. The Bay Area's first professional women's soccer team, Bay FC, playing for the first time in front of their home crowd. But breaking news first out of San Jose, we have just learned that San Jose police have evacuated a building on Lee Avenue. They say it's because of a chemical exposure. This is near San Jose City College, and all we know is that they are asking people to avoid that area as soon as we... <laughs> And back to our other top story, the team ended up losing to the Houston Dash. Before the game, our Amanda Perry talked with supporters about being there to witness Bay FC history. 18,000 tickets were sold for Bay FC's first home game here at PayPal Park. Fans say this is a historic moment, both for Bay Area sports and for women's sports, and they wanted to be a part of it.